Scoring a video is about setting a mood and telling a story through that mood. For us, telling the story has to include emotive music and compelling soundtrack. My name is Jay Case. Uh, I'm a musician based in Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario. Come from a very musical family. I'm a songwriter as well. I've been writing songs for just about as long as I've been playing. I, I tour, I've toured most of Canada into the United States. I even toured Germany a couple of years ago uh, with uh, original music. Music it touches every aspect of my life. Very few points in the day I'm not listening to music. There's very few points in the day I'm not thinking about new music and writing. And it dovetails really nicely with other things that I do in my life. So I used to get out in nature all the time. I've been doing that since before I could remember. I never saw those things meeting until I couldn't tour anymore. My partner and I, Sherry, we started going camping a lot more and canoeing because we had the time for it. And then it became a musical outlet for me as well because we started a YouTube channel. For a period of time, I couldn't write. I just had serious writer's block. It gives me the opportunity to score the videos and to write new material, to write new music, even repurposing old music that I have recorded and toured for years and just shedding new light on it and using that to score videos, which is a unique thing in the, uh, in the, in the world that we're in, I think. Sometimes canoe tripping is tough. Completing just 30 kilometers in two long days of travel, we'd face some grueling challenges. Over the past year, we've started improving a fair bit with our storytelling. We don't want to just show videos of us traveling through the forest. We want to tell a story. We want to connect with people. I actually get really excited, and I watch the video through the, the rough edit, and then I sit down with an instrument, whether it be piano or guitar or something else, and then just sort of build that emotion of the certain parts so that it flows well. Definitely the, the footage will dictate the music. And then I just try to write music or choose the music that best suits the mood that's being set or the emotion that we want to convey. And then when it gets close and I show to Sherry because she gets the final say on the edits uh, and she sort of starts nodding and she's in agreement that it's good, then yeah, it's, it's, um, it's pretty special. It's like, I did that, that's cool. It feels great to finish a video. It's like music though, you never feel like it's done, but you have to let it go at some point. So I sometimes hear music while we're actually out in the forest. So if you're doing a really, really difficult portage, a lot of people tend to hear certain things. I hear music. I'll actually come up with a rhythm, maybe the rhythm of my feet or my steps. There's always ideas popping in our heads, even when we're out there in the middle of the forest. 